Good morning. Hi, wow, you, you have the most energy out of all of us, so congrats. <laughs> we'll take some. The new season is so... It's so much fun because it feels like we're starting to get some answers and things are being revealed. You know, Melissa, starting with you, I'm curious, you know, she's not a cop anymore, but she's certainly sleuthing a lot still. Um, uh, you know, how, always. <laughs> well, I'm curious, you know, how she's dealing with the callings and the mysteries this season, would you say? Yeah, you can take her out of the precinct, but she'll still be a detective. Um It'll, she is put in a really interesting position because Ben's obviously dealing with a lot. He's, you know, lost his daughter. He's lost his wife. Um, he's not really focused on the callings at the moment. And so she's kind of been, you know, she's tasked herself with um, running the, you know, the ship on herself by herself. And um, she has Zeke, but that's also, you know, she's also lost her partner in a lot of ways, um, Jared, because she was, left with a decision about what to do with the love triangle. And we do get to see the results of that. Um, and so she's kind of operating on her own a lot, but you know, she still has all of, she still has Cal. Um, and she's kind of the one who's mainly going out on these calling missions to figure out what's going on. Well, Josh, you know, Ben, Ben starts out at a pretty dark place this season. The beard looked amazing, by the way, I just have to say. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. One of my great achievements in life was growing that beard. Michaela tried to grow one too, but it didn't look quite as good. <laughs> I think he would have rocked it. I think well, I How is too. he dealing now? Because obviously this hunt, you know, for his daughter is is taking over his whole life. Yeah, I, I think the hunt for uh, Eden is all consuming for him. You know, he starts off season four in a really dark place, as we were just saying, and he has abandoned everything, including uh, the people that love him most and the people that are closest to him, which is why Michaela has been left on her own to try to figure this out because as far as Ben is concerned, the callings have given him nothing. They've only taken from him. And he can't quite see a way out of that. So he sort of digs in and builds not only camp, but like a, a fortress in his grief. And he's not leaving it. And he's not giving up uh, on finding his daughter. So it is the only thing that he is concerned about and focused on. The last thing I want to know is, you know, do, do you come into a new season with your own suspicions, either of you, things that you're thinking about and you're like, look, you know, look, I expect this or no? I give I gave up season two or three where I was just like, I they have the answers and my guesses are so far off that it's not even worth it. <laughs> Andrew, I think we're all just along for the ride. <laughs> yeah, it's a fun ride. <laughs> It is a fun ride, it is. and it gets more it and is. more fun. Well, I can't wait to see how the season wraps up. Thank you both so much for the time. Thank Thanks, you, Andrew. Andrew. Nice talking to you. 